This USA MVP, I'm here to talk about the Manny Pacquiao versus Timothy Bradley fight that happened last night. Last night, a lot of people believe that there was a robbery. I don't think it was a robbery, but I do think Manny Pacquiao won the fight. One judge had it. 115, 113 for Manny Pacquiao. Another two judges had it for Bradley with the same score. If you paid attention to my last video, uh, my prediction of the fight, I said that there was some controversy about the fight. The controversy to me was that Timothy Bradley, who I picked to win the fight, but I said that there was a controversy because he has not beaten anybody that's substantial at 147 pounds for him to be fighting Manny Pacquiao. Now, Pacquiao had other options he could have chose. He could have chose Victor Ortiz. He could have chose Andre Berto. He could even went up and wait and came with a catch weight for Sergio Martinez. But he didn't take any of those. Which, Victor Ortiz and... Berto were scheduled to fight each other, but in the case of Manny Pacquiao having to fight them, they would have thrown out their fight for that reason. Manny Pacquiao, just like Floyd Mayweather, interfered when uh, Mosley was supposed to fight Andre Berto. That fight didn't come about. Now, going into the fight last night, I had Manny Pacquiao winning the fight. But not such a wide margin like the, the fans are making it seem out to be. I had Bradley winning the first round, the second round, the 10th, 11th, and 12th round. That's five rounds. Some people say some rounds are iffy between there. But during the middle of the fight, from the third round... Up until the tenth round, up until the ninth round, I had Manny Pacquiao winning the fight, and he did it in pretty good fashion. But he was not able to close the show on Bradley, which I thought he should have been able to do. Bradley hung in there just based on his will, and he got caught with a lot of shots. And to Bradley's defense, when Manny Pacquiao hits Bradley, of course Manny Pacquiao hits harder, but the crowd goes ooh and ah. So that, that played a factor into it. So some of the rounds that I think that Bradley won, people are not going to believe that he won. A lot of the times in the beginning of the rounds, Manny Pacquiao took the first minute of the fight off. Just taking the fight off, running around. Not to say Bradley took advantage of it and was dominating because he was not doing any of, anything like that. But... In this fight, like I said before in my prediction video, I think the reason that this happened was because Pacquiao's promotional company, Top Rank, knows that Pacquiao has one or two fights left, and they need a new star. They don't have any other money makers besides Manny Pacquiao. And by Bradley winning this fight, it leaves options open for him. Now he has a fan base because people hate him because... He robbed Manny, Pac Manny Pacquiao. So he's going to get fans and he's going to get pay-per-views based off the fact of that. That was the reason why this happened. This was, like I said, it was a passing of the torch. Now they have another moneymaker in case Manny Pacquiao decides to not fight Mayweather or to retire. Then they have something that they can fall back on. Let me know what you think.